Hey everyone, I hope your day is excellent. So I told you I was getting a palette in, and I did. So I'm going to show you what this palette is. Now, it's not a new release. Um, they've had this palette on their site for a while, but um, I just bought it. I didn't buy it on their site. I bought it somewhere else. But as soon as I saw the palette, I liked it immediately, and I wanted to buy it. So, um, they were sold out on their site, so I bought this on a different site. And I will be putting that, that site <coughs> excuse me, in the description box at the bottom. Alright, so I have not opened this at all. This is the first I'm seeing of it. And it's brand new. This is the first we're all going to see of it. This is LA Colors After Party 20 Color Eyeshadow Palette. Right? And I just think this is so pretty. Look at that. Alright. And um, it has... Uh, a mix they're mainly excuse me mainly dark colors this is the ingredients and that is a picture of the palette which we are going to look at here in just a second all right so I got this on sale. It retailed on LA Colors for $8.99. And the site that I bought this on, the entire charge came to a little over $11. So, again, I will be putting that website and the link to this palette in the description box so you can check it out okay so the outer box look at this look at that I just like that so much so pretty this was the only palette like this of this like this one on their site they had several other palettes, but not like this one. And I liked it as soon as I saw it. All right. Now the open. Okay, so. Just a minute. I'm opening the palette. Oh, wait. Let me see. Okay, so it has a clear pack plastic. There we go. All right, this has a mirror on the inside, all right, which I won't be showing you, but this is how the palette looks, and it does have plastic over the colors. Look at that. Whoops, look at that. Aren't they beautiful? Okay. Oh my goodness, there's so many shimmers in here. And there's one, two, three, six. Six mattes. Six mattes, which is perfect for me because the rest are all shimmers and they're all dark. Mostly dark colors. Oh my goodness, isn't that awesome? Look how pretty that is. I just like it so much. So I'm trying to get this up as close to you as possible. And then a big, big mirror. A big mirror. Okay. A really big mirror. Alright. So what I'm going to do. Um, and there's like a, a film thingy over the mirror. Which I'm just leaving. Because there's no reason for me to take that off. Okay. So I'm gently taking the plastic off. The colors and I'm going to swatch for you 
and then we are doing a look. Oh my goodness. Look at these, these colors are just oh, awesome. Okay, so sans the um plastic. This is how the colors look. And they are so beautiful. Look at that. How pretty they are. Alright, so I'm going to swatch these with the finger. Okay? And then um, I'm going to do a look. So I'm starting from the bottom row. Bottom row. Okay? And I'm starting where the blue is. And I'm working my way down. There's the blue. And I'm going to work my way across. My arm is going to be swatched. So... Oh, man. Oh, boy. First swatch. Look at that. That's the blue. Okay, blue is going to be in the front. Okay. And then a matte is next. And then another matte. This is the perfect palette for me. Seriously, there are a few mattes. And the rest are all shimmers. This is awesome. Oh my goodness. Just wait till you see this. Alright, so I'm going to get a wipe so I can wipe my hands. So, just a minute. But, look at that color. Look at that color. Isn't that awesome? Oh my goodness. I really like shimmers. Shimmers are my favorite. All right, so this is the bottom row, and this is the big start. This is the start from my wrist on down. This is what they look like. All right, and there are um, there are mats in here. Not many. The rest of them are shimmers, and I really like that. Okay, then. Uh, this is the rest of the um, swatches on the bottom row, and I'm going to wipe these off and swatch the rest. All right. All right. I'm going to swatch the rest now. All right, everybody. This is the top row, and the top row starts with a gray to a silver shimmer. All right, and then uh, one really deep pink and one really lighter pink. Well, mo more medium, I guess. And then a rust-like, and then a matte, a purple, then, and a lavender-esque, okay? And then another matte, which is like uh, tan-ish, and a taupey, a really light taupey, and then the last one is a shimmer, all right, all right, so now I'm going to do that look for you, so I rarely, rarely use matte colors, matte colors are really not my, um, thing. I have used them for transition colors. Um, like, um, since I don't actually have an area for a transition color, like, uh, most people would put the transition color in their crease. My eyes are not big enough for that, so I have all of my lower lid. So, sometimes what I've done is put a matte color, um, a lighter matte color or something coordinating all across my lid and then apply my shimmer colors and or glitter colors. That's how I've done that. I'm not going to be doing that today. Uh, today I'm going to line my eyes with a uh, Supreme Colca gel. Oh, and that reminds me. I ran out. I have Su Milani Supreme Colca gel. And then I have Milani, uh, 20, 17 hour wear in the automatic pen and Milani 17 hour wear in the liquid, uh, 
uh, liner. This is Supreme Cold Gel, also Milani, and this is what I'll be using to line my waterline. And then I will be finishing uh, my liner off with my liquid. So, before I get to that, though, I will be using my primer, which is Milani also. And this sets in uh, 30 seconds. And this has a color um, when it first comes out. It's similar. It looks a lot like a uh, uh, primer potion. And then it sets. Uh, the applicator is different from primer potion, but it works really, really well. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get going to get everything together and then I'm going to start with this look. All right, so um, I got my liner on well somewhat. There's a little bit I need to fix there, but this is what mine looks like without. Uh, eye makeup and I'm not wearing any foundation today so that's what my face looks like sans foundation all right so I'm going to remind that and then I'm going to get started on this palette so what I'm going to do today is um, I guess we could do something festive so I think what I'm going to do, okay. so I'm going to put this pink, I'll show you, the light pink right there in the inner corner, okay, and then I'm going to take um, the red right next to, to the brown mat, okay, and put that in the middle, and then, actually I probably could put the gold, but yeah, I guess I'll put the gold in the middle, and then I'll put the red on the end, that's what I'll do, and then I'll probably be putting another color underneath my lashes, so, um, um, all right, so I'll be done in just a minute. And I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so I have my high colors on and I fixed my liner and underneath my lower lash line is purple. I'll put the purple underneath there. And what I did was I used the pink and then there are two golds. There's a lighter gold and a darker gold. And I put the lighter gold first. And then um, um, I decided I wanted to try the darker gold on there as well. So I did that. And then. And then. Um, so I started with the pink. I started with the pink. There we go. And then um, I used both of the gold. And the gold is. Here. Gold. And then there's a gold in the corner here. So I did that. And then I used this red. That's what I did on the corner, it, on the outer corner, and then I used the purple. Um, yeah, I used the purple underneath my lower lash line, and um, I lined with um, my Milani uh, liquid liner. Um, I will not be using um, a mascara today because the only mascara I have is the Wet n Wild mascara that uh, I don't like. Um, I ran out of my benefit 
so I will not be using um, a mascara today. Um, but uh, I love the palette. I like it very much. I think the colors are beautiful, and um, I will probably be using um, this palette again uh, upcoming um, and doing different color combinations. So, I think that is all. Um, this is my liquid liner that I use. All right. This is Milani Stay Put Matte. 17 hour wear waterproof and it is just like uh this is milani could supreme cold Cajal, but they also have a sharp pencil that has to be sharpened that is exactly like this and they also have an automatic scroll up pen that is just like this so if you don't want it to sharpen a pencil you have the option of that. All right. So I think that is all for now. Um, that's all for this video. Um, uh, I have more videos on their way really soon. So be ready for that. Lurkers, you know you want to subscribe. Subs, thank you for subbing. And incoming, incoming subs, welcome. And... Um, I think, I think that's about it for now. So everyone have a great day and I will see you all in my next video. Have a good one, everybody.